Hello and welcome to my Fire Monkey video blog. In this short video I will give you additional infos how to use my hint unit um, with other components than the standard comp components that are delivered with um, DEFI. You can use the hint unit uh, for example also with uh, the components from uh, TMS. You can see here uh, on the form and TMS FMX font size picker and also an uh, TMS uh, FMX speed button. I have already included my um, hint unit and uh, this works. Um, I show it short. You call once set a hint and then the name of the control and the text for this and that's all. So let's start it and let's see how it works. So we have here this um, form and when I move the mouse pointer over this element so we have then the hint text and also here at the button. But uh, you can use this uh, unit also with uh, some specialized controls from TMS. I show you another thing. Therefore we will open uh, the spell checker demo from TMS. So, here we have it. So let us start the demo from TMS and the editor and uh, we have it here and uh, when we move the mouse pointer over the several buttons there is uh, no explanation, no hints. Uh, for some of the buttons it is clear what they are standing for but uh, for other buttons it is not and so it would be really helpful if we would have here also some hints and it is not so uh, complicated as you think perhaps. I show you it once. I have uh, already integrated my um, hint unit and uh, one other special unit that is uh, unit hints for TMS and when we look here in the uh, creation event so then we need only this single line set CMS edit hints and uh, you can choose the language by setting an uh, EN or DE I use here EN so, and when we now move the mouse pointer over some buttons or elements, we have uh, an explanation, some hints, and uh, so it is much e more easier for the user to understand what he uh, can do here. So, and I show you short how we have managed this. When we here follow uh, the set TMS edit thing hints uh, procedure, we can see um, here is the edit toolbar, the format toolbar, and the proofing toolbar uh, as parameter given to this procedure. And uh, we're checking first what language should be used and if these. Um, format toolbars and edit toolbars and so on are already created and if that's, a, that's the case uh, we use set a hint and the hint that uh, is corresponding to the language and that is all so that you have only to integrate this unit into your application and uh, this one call and so you have the hints for this um, controls from TMS. So that means you can use my hints units for every component that is uh, a successor from the uh, T control and so I think the most components are this 
and uh, you can use this unit so for a wide range of uh, components. That's all for today. Bye.